So the next thing to get sorted is another window um, and because Rob and Glenn have done such a fantastic job in the turret I wanted to get some of the windows sorted in there um, I'm not handy So this is one of the windows for the turret um, obviously the glass is out and the frames are a bit battered it's not in as bad shape as some of the other ones um, so it should be okay so I'm just going to take this cover off um, and then I'll have a little look, see what I need to get sorted with it, give it a sand, get some wood hardener and filler on it, and then go from there. So it's on a uh, window number, God knows how many, <laughs> <laughs> there's just too many to keep track of, um, but it's another one of the original ones for the top of the tower, um, and this one's in quite a bad state isn't it? Mm -hmm. yep. So obviously we're needing, it did have some brackets on the back to strengthen it originally anyway, so we've just counted sunk those in so we can put some filler on so they won't look as yeah. nasty will they? That was brilliant. Um, so now it's been sanding the whole thing, so we've got all of the old paint off on the front and back. Yep. And the next stage is to start looking at getting some filler on um, just the amount of wood that's rotted on it. So we're going to start on the internal part, which obviously is going to be the original part for the wood. And we're going to use some of the dark wood filler. So hopefully it'll blend in once we've waxed it all. So it's going to be a first for you. Yep. I'm going to show you the first little bit and leave you to it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so it'll be great obviously for some skills um, and obviously to see how it turns wow. out as well because once you see it in this state you just think it's you, you can't save it yes and then once it's you obviously you've seen some of the yes. ones that I've done yeah 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 so it's it's a a nice sort of um, transformation yeah yes yes like sense of achievement to, to bring it back to life mm -hmm. so the filler that we're going to use is the on seal we're going to mix a bit of this with a hardener we'll put it on and we've got a bigger profile this time because quite a lot of the wood's rotten. Once that's done we'll flip it over and we'll start on doing the white part. So yeah? Yep. You ready? Yes. Let's get going. Okay.
So while Anara's tackling the window, I've decided to come upstairs on the top of the tower and tackle another job. Now this panel on the top of the window up here is obviously quite damaged. Um, over the years, water's been getting in and obviously just rotting it away bit by bit. So I need either repairing or replacing. So I'm going to try and get it down, see how bad the damage is and see if there's any way that we can try and save it um, and then pop it back in place. If not, if it is a bit too far gone, then we're going to have to have a look, see if we can try and replace it somehow. But it'd be good if we can try and keep it, keep the original wood and obviously just keep to the, the history of what's actually there. So what I'll do is I'll get down now, see what state it's in and go from there. So that's the panel back in and I can't believe how well it's turned out. It looks absolutely fantastic. Um, obviously I've managed to save the original panel and um, add a new piece in, and repair it, give it a wax and pop it back in place and it just looks as good as new. Just looks like it's always been there really. Um, and obviously it's still got the age marks on it so it's, it doesn't look like it's too new and it stands out. It just follows the whole sort of feel with the rest of the chateau. So it's good, I'm really pleased with how it's turned out. 
what I'll do now is I'll go down, see how Nara's getting on with the window, and hopefully she's getting the first coat of paint on with it. But yeah, hell of a good job done. So while we're cracking on with work up in the tower um, and getting all the wax sorted, we've come to a section in the roof where uh, previously there must have been a leak in there and it's damaged quite a lot of the boards. Obviously they're in a pretty bad state, obviously the back's even worse. Um, there's just nothing left, even these have gone a bit too far um, for me to try and bring them back and to restore them. So there's three that I've took out here, one's not too bad, um, hopefully we'll be able to save that one and do sync with that one. But the other two, they've warped, um, obviously they're all just stained with the water um, and they've just completely just rotted away with the woodworm as well. So these two we're not going to be able to use, so I'm going to have to try and um, replicate them. Now they just look like normal decent sized floorboards. But they've got a tiny detail which you can see which runs right the way along it um, and it's just got like a sort of like a semicircle chamfer on it um, my router's broke so I can't use a router and everyone's on holiday in France at the minute so I can't get anyone to to make it for us so I'm gonna hopefully try and have a go and doing it myself so in the garage I managed to find a floorboard um, which is the right width which is pretty much exactly the same wood as well. So that'll do for one of them. And then I've got some more wood, which I'll be able to use for the second one. Um, and my idea is I'm gonna try and run the circular saw. Um, so far, I think it's about a centimeter away from the edge and about half centimeter deep. I'll run that along to get the straight line. And then I'm gonna try chiseling each side of that um, to give us a curve and then once I've given it a sand hopefully it'll look exactly the same so like I said, I'll start on um, this one for now see how it gets sorted and then go from there
Another good week. It has been good. Getting more stuff sorted in the tower. Yeah. More windows. More windows. <laughs> more terrace. <laughs> more panelling. Can I call him the window man? <laughs> I know. Well, I'm getting there, getting them sorted. Obviously, our main focus was to get the chateau watertight. Yeah. And it's, yes. it is getting there. Just sort of there. I think it'll be ready for the winter, won't it? Yeah. yeah. By winter, we'll have a piece of glass in every window, which will be good. Yeah. Um, the tower, obviously, the windows in there were in a, a bad state, weren't they? I think they, every window in there was original. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. 1800s. It's not, these aren't new windows, these no, aren't new them. locks, clasps, nothing. pieces of wood. There's nothing. No. It's all old. Yeah. And they were all in a really bad, bad, bad state. Same some weather, haven't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. Really bad state. So, like I said, it's another one ticked off the list. Um, obviously, Inara done an amazing job helping out with that. Obviously, it helped me, and obviously, she learnt some new skills with it. Yeah. So, that was brilliant. Mm -hmm. It's a good job she was okay on her uh, tightrope, though. I, I mean, know. she had no really problems good. up there, I, did I she? I can't do it. I literally, as soon as I get up there, I just feel sick. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But, um, but, yeah, so it's good that we've got that done. Mm -hmm. Then I got the little panel under yeah, the window Yeah, I mean, sorted. making that as well, out of just finding an old, old piece of wood, didn't yeah. you? It's tremendous, yeah. finding some wood that matches and doing that. But again, that, that tower has leaked at some point. That roof's been redone in the not-so-distant history of the chateau. Yeah. So yeah. we know that it's it's had water running down the insides of it yeah. and all sorts. So it's good to see it coming back to Coming back, life. yeah. Um, so that was done, and then the, obviously the boards above it as well. Mm -hmm. See, so yeah, it's, it's all yeah. good. It's and then looking like something now, isn't it? Yeah, Mum and Tony have been helping in the chateau as well, haven't you? The yeah, that's the week. Week. Yeah, yeah. Well, because we had family over, we thought, well, you know, we'll, it'd be easier as all working together. Um, so you were doing, you were doing a bit of this and that with Pete, weren't you? And got, so we instead we of all over the place, yeah, yeah, instead of concentrating on the cottage, we thought we'd just do bits in the chateau. So yeah. I yeah, got yeah. the door. Well, you started the door, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, we got the door frame yeah. uh, repaired mm -hmm. because that was in pretty poor. Yeah, so, uh, as with everything, bad. just where it's got got soggy at the bottom. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah, the yeah. rest of it was fine. Just the bottom section needed replacing. Then. Yeah. Luckily, we found a couple of pieces of, of stuff lying around that were exact profile match, so it was tremendous. So it's just a couple of undercoats now, isn't it? And um, just finishing the top coats on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and that's just going to be shining. Yeah, <laughs> it's going to look amazing to have yeah. the, the little door at the bottom of the tower done yeah. and then the all of the windows. I've yeah. got one window that I'm working on um, on the front of the tower that should be done in the next week or mm -hmm. so. I'm just waiting for the glass. It's glass and, and then the it? whole centre part of the tower is yeah. all completely yeah. done. And the yeah. finishing touch is a little cat flap for Pandy that's just arrived. So yeah, yeah. yeah. got a little cat flap Whether she'll it. use it or not, another matter. Oh, she loves a cat flap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she can't go nowhere, but. No, <laughs> no but it looks nice. Yeah. <laughs> I thought Terry might have put a little chateau door in, but he was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> What's a chateau door? Well, a nice little wooden one, you know. <laughs> a wooden door and a wooden door? No, yeah. well, yes, like a little wooden door. How is a cat going to use that? Pandy's <laughs> very clever, isn't she? <laughs> Ringing the doorbell. Oh, Pandy's very, very clever. <laughs> hey, and we had a, a lovely parcel we arrive. Did, yes. Uh, we did absolutely beautiful. We couldn't believe it. We couldn't believe how much was in it. No. Um, it it's amazing. Of Jeff and uh, Georgia, yeah, um, from America. I, we we just couldn't believe it. The first thing I saw was this, yeah. and the first thing I claimed was this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like if Grace had gone into a shop, she'd have bought that. Yes, yeah. did, definitely. Straight away, that's what I said. Yeah. As soon as we opened the box, I said, if I'd walked into any like crafty shop or you know you do nice ones this is the first thing i you would have, have actually up. bought well, it's just been, beautiful. It been in the window it would have been the yeah, thing that drew you into the shop to start lovely with. Yeah. Yeah. lovely lovely but yeah. everything in there it's, yeah. it's as if like you know it's, it's, like it's like christmas come early yes yeah. yeah. there's a couple of bits obviously i've seen in there that were very nice yeah. So, <laughs> he's very happy with Terry believe me them. yeah we'll put them in the shower. a little candle yeah. wicker as well wasn't yeah. it yeah it's all sorts it's tremendous thank you really i mean it um it cost a lot to send and it cost a lot to put together and it's a lot of the um, thought behind thought, it's thoughts gone so, into so it, yeah. much gone into it yes. it's really tremendous a lot of thoughts so we really you. appreciate it it it's is lovely. very much appreciated yeah it's just nice and i love it so thank you to georgia <laughs> and jeff, jeff harris, harris. Mm -hmm. yep yeah. i'm it's amazing yeah um, and yeah that's it we'll see you when are we going wednesday wednesday, uh, wednesday. wednesday again. i don't know what is going on in the cottage no idea. It's getting there. It's inching closer. <laughs> it, it is. It, it's well, like we're, we're. It's all a bitty yeah. job. We're, we're at the bitty point now. Yeah, yeah we're yeah. finishing off bits of trims, fixing the yeah. uh, units to the mm. wall, 
final positioning them so that the mm -hmm. the things like the cooker and the washing machine are going to fit properly mm -hmm. and, and then getting all of the the dimensions for the worktop so and we can move on to those. Mm -hmm. so yeah. I did drag Terry on a two hour trip, well, <laughs> a four hour round trip to get something that for the cottage yeah. that I truly adore. <laughs> and I've searched everywhere and to find it in France was a miracle. Yeah. Uh, so miracles do happen. <laughs> yeah, even in yeah. France. Yeah. <laughs> even in France. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so I dragged Terry on a little. It, it was worth it. Yeah, it was and like nice. I said, it's nice. It's things that Mum's always wanted. Yeah, so I'll so show you it. that for uh, Wednesday, but it's, it's lovely. Yeah, and Perfect. then the work tops. Uh, you just went out shopping and had a look at some work tops. Yeah, we, we've seen something mm -hmm. that we quite fancy, um, an alternative to wood um, or, or granite. So we'll see what yeah, we'll uh, see what comes with that. Back, yeah. yeah, they mm -hmm. need some sizes off us. So Definitely. I'm just trying to pull. That's why I'm pulling everything together to get some fairly close to sizes and then we'll see what uh, see what happens with those yeah obviously everyone that said not to go with wood obviously yeah. thank you because we aren't <laughs> yeah we're not, not. going to go with wood um so yeah so we'll see what we get sorted with that and mm -hmm. go from there mm -hmm. yeah yeah we'll go to that and we will see you on wednesday, wednesday. yeah we will yeah okay thank you bye-bye <laughs> see you on wednesday bye au revoir if you'd like to join us on our family journey bring them back this once forgotten chateau, then please join us on Patreon for behind the scenes footage, updates, live chat and your very own piece of the chateau.